guys, welcome back to another video. And today we have the stars of our channel, our yellow crazy ants. So you can see right here, they're eating a cockroach. And there's a few workers. The colony's doing pretty good because I saw a few of the workers carrying eggs, a whole clump of eggs. This is gonna be like a little update video. Uh, I'm gonna try adding some more moss around. There's their honey sugar bowl. And um, actually one thing pretty cool about this terrarium is that um, there are snails and many other insects. There are wild cockroaches, snails, and micro insects living in here which are eating all the ants poop and any other decaying matter like over there. So. Um, the person who sold this to me did a pretty good job in making it a good place. And uh, you can see there are a few yellow crazy ants. They do spray formic acid, but I've never been sprayed before. They're surprisingly not that much, but earlier when I put the GoPro near them, there were way more. But then I think the GoPro may have scared them away. We And now they are dragging a piece of roach away. The, the reason why they're dragging away this cockroach is because they want to get it out of the open as soon as possible. So, because um, if they were in the wild, things like birds and other ants might steal their food. So they're really in a hurry. That's why they don't eat on the spot. They drag it back into their nest where they um, eat it. And uh, the reason why I know these ants are doing well is because, as I said, I watered them and I saw the eggs. Not the pupae, because um, they they're kind of like caterpillars. They first turn into eggs, then a separate stage, another stage, another stage. Um, first it's eggs, larvae, pupae, ants, I'm pretty sure. And I do see tons of um, pupae and things like that. I'll try showing that in another video. And it looks pretty cool because it's like they're in a cocoon, sort of. So you guys can now just look. Oh yeah, and over here is the entrance to one of their nests. Here, and here, and also here, and here. I'm pretty sure they live underneath this huge log. I reinforce the baby powder once every week since it's getting more humid. I have to replace it more often. I just mix it in with some baby powder and water and I apply in a circular motion to make sure um, every single crevice gets um, baby powdered. So there you guys have it, a full update on our yellow crazy ants. Nothing big has been going on, but I do find it's a little bit hard to feed them sometimes because they reject the food a lot. So uh, yeah, that's your update. Bye guys. I'll be leaving a poll up in that corner um, for if we should get another ant colony. And, uh, well, I'll see you on the next adventure. Bye.